Dog mushing is my life. Uh, dogs are, yeah, everything for me. So of course the, the mushers are also like family for me. Well, I got my first Siberian Husky '79, and it kind of started from there. Soon uh, after that, I started to go, go over to mixed breed. Started to compete with uh, eight, six dog team and eight dog team. I got injured when I was uh, training my dog and the trail was very, very icy. Downhill with the big bumps, I fell off the sled and hit my back, so I got a spinal cord injury. And I'm paralyzed from about from the navel and down. Of course, after an accident like that, you get very depressed, feel bad, and uh, you really don't maybe want to go on, and you try to find something, something to, that would help you to put your life back together. And my dear master friends from back in the days, they saw how badly I felt. So they gave me a puppy with the words and said, that stop feeling so sorry for yourself, take care of this puppy instead. So that's how I started again. First I thought, oh, this, this will be difficult. How can I go out with the dog, uh, with the wheelchair and everything? And uh, he started to pull my wheelchair and we had a lot of fun. When winter came, I was wondering how would I uh, exercise this dog? And I got an idea that I borrow a sit -ski. Then I went out to, to, on a trail with the dog and uh, he pulled me right away and we had lots of fun and I felt, okay, I'm back on the trail again. After the storm, I'm not a match, simply waiting. Oh, that was a good tour. Oh, that was a good race. I always take some snow with me just in case there is not enough around the car. First of all, uh, to be able to go on the snow and also have been able to fix e equipment has not existed before and uh, find out that oh really it works very good and I, I can compete in uh, f with four dog class and uh, okay I maybe I don't win but uh, I am not last either. The community has really st uh, stepped up and all, uh, every time I come to a race or some other place people are always helping out. Not every musher has this luxury, from the kids to the old guys. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's amazing how the people, uh, uh, yeah, help me. Well, I'm not really there as I was before. I, I will never be there. But this is the, 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 I'm here, I'm in the mushing business different way. And it's as rewarding, maybe even more rewarding because, yeah, my situation. It's a great feeling. <laughs>